No, something more sensible. Something that's gotta be done. Hey, when the timing's right, you're gonna take old Trevor and put him out to pasture. Oh, me? See, Michael will be sensible, but Trevor... Trevor won't be. Trevor is a liability that none of us can afford. Man, Trevor saved you. He saved both y'all asses. And it's unfortunate. Hey, when we give you the word, you're gonna do this thing. Man, get Michael to do it. Me and Trevor cool, dawg. Michael can't do it. Trevor won't let him near. That's why it's up to you, homie. Oh, fuck. Hey, who is that? Nobody. Don't worry about it, nigga. Hey. Oh, flossing ass nigga. Too close! Revolutionary from the kingdom of Earth. You made it. Good. I saved you. Again, Davey. Again. So what are you going to do for me about Haynes, the rest of the FIB, the IAA, and everyone else, huh? History's written by the living, okay? We can pin most of it on Agent Sanchez. 
I get that story right and the agency and bureau will back off. The problem we need to deal with is Trevor. Trevor? Why? Try Merriweather, Chinese gangsters, general insanity, and so on. I can sp been Steve that you're controllable, but not Trevor. Steve. He's our wounded hero right now. I gotta cozy up to him, calm him down. Just get me out. I'm home! Buddy. Get in the back, Pop! Hey, across the street! Yo, what's up? A stretch limo. Oh, that's pure class, Jim. The Oriental Theater on Vinewood Boulevard. Open that champagne, Jimbo. Woohoo! Me and the big dog getting our drink on. Hey, hey, where you going with that? Woo! My dad's a movie oh, for this Nice side. work. Jimmy, get back down here! Which makes me a movie producer's kid! Jimmy! I'm gonna ride out the next two recessions without ever having to work! And I'm gonna get a sports car and a drug habit! Before appearing on Reality Rehab Show! And then, 
I'm gonna sell my story and become really judgmental. And I'm gonna use all the contacts I make in treatment programs to become a producer too. And I'm gonna make even shittier movies than my dad does. Cause I don't care about movies like him. For me, it's just an opportunity thing. Woo! Yeah! You see the street's edge losers? Chisel in the movie bizzle. Hear that, Finewood? You hear that, Finewood? Hey, I hear it, and I don't like it. We're going to the Oriental Theater on Vinewood Boulevard. Get back down here. And not to, like, gawk at celebrities from behind a barrier. We're actually, like, properly invited. V to the I to the P. Jimmy! Read my necros! Entitled! E N T! Entitled! Cause I am! Jimmy! Oh, Pop, chill! I'm done spraying this shizzle. Let's take a drink. Nice move. Jimmy, shut up a second. Hey, Devin, look. I need to say about Molly, man. I'm sorry, but I didn't do it. I told you to slow it down, slick! It was an accident. I was there, but I had nothing to do with it. Sure, yeah, hey! You made a fool out of me, Michael, and that is something I'm not gonna forget! Look, Devin, I said I'm sorry. I feel bad for you, but you don't threaten me, because this movie's happening, all right? So let's just calm down and try to be friends again. Oh, absolutely, Slick. Forgive and forget. Namaste! Hi, you know, I'm really proud of you, even though you did make a pretty shitty movie. Oh, thank you, Jim. Where are the girls? Uh, they're at home. You know, they'll uh, express their pride by showing up really late. Uh, of course they will. Thanks, Antonio. Give me nice and tight. Hey, it's Laszlo on the red carpet of Meltdown. Some big stars, some beautiful dresses. We're gonna see some side boot tonight. Come on. We did it! Solomon! We fucking did it! Fucking A! <laughs> Fuck you, fate! I may be a lecherous old has-been, but I'm a has-been with a premiere at the Oriental Theater on Vinewood Boulevard. I'll see you in there, kid. Hey, thanks. Enjoy the picture, everyone! Mr. Richards! Mr. Richards, hi. If I could just bother you for a second. Um, I'm Laszlo from uh, Famer Shame, um, but I do some acting on the side. I was wondering if... Uh... Oh, yeah, of course. You should come see me, kid. I think I got a project that would be perfect for you. Oh, that's fantastic. It's called The Closet. Really modern stuff. <laughs> Pervert. Come on. No, 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 no. Let's go over She's here. lying, okay? I never had surgery. Come on. Milton, Milton, hi. Sorry to bother you. Quick question. Get in here tight. Um... Love, love, loved the movie. Oh, thank you so much. I appreciate it. When, when you were that polar bear and you had to eat your baby, I mean, that okay. was... Okay. All right, Jesus Christ. That was emotional. Stick and I just have a hug. Okay. That really affected me. All right, I gotta go. Thank you so much. Excuse me. Excuse me. Come on. Come on, let's get in there. Ah, Laszlo. Oh, shit. Come on, shit dick. <laughs> <laughs> Where the hell is she? Looks like she stood you up. Hope I'm not too late. I wouldn't miss this for the world. Devin, the fuck are you doing here? Hey, what a movie, huh? Meltdown. Congratulations, Mikey. We did it. Hey, let's get a picture, huh? You, me, the proud producer. Such a pleasure working with you. You see, I was here. Unlike your wife. Seems to be stuck at home. <laughs> you twisted fuck. You're a dead man. Let's go, Jim. Come on. Hold on! Where's Mom and Tracy? Come on! The girls might be in trouble at the house! Yeah. What the house is not happening. Hey girl, what, you doing? what happened? I don't know. I don't know. This rich asshole is pissed off at me because I didn't shit can the movie. And then his lawyer died, and, and he just told me he's gonna hurt your mom. You killed his lawyer? And now he's gonna kill Mom and Tracy? He ain't gonna do anything if I got a say in it. But you fucking killed his lawyer? No, I didn't. It was an accident. I would never do anything to put you in danger. Shit. All right. Okay. They'll be fine. They're tough. This is just a movie guy, right? He's not a gangster or anything. 
No, he's not a gangster. He's just extremely rich. He says he's got all these connections. I'm sure it's just talk. Everything's gonna be okay. Shit, what's that car? All right, Jimmy, you keep yourself concealed. I'll go get the girls. Stay here. Keep your heads down. Be safe, baby. Don't you worry about me. Clear the building! No one leaves! Frag out! Give me some cover! Uh -oh. Not yet! Stay put! Take that flag! Neither do I. Just keep calm. I need you to for me, asshole. You dirtbag. Close it. Ah! Ah! We're Back up. Fire. Say no something. Way. Give me cover. Ah! Ah! Jesus. gonna kill you. Daddy's got this. Trace! Amanda! I think they're gone! Oh. I got you, you dick! Oh. 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 Be all right. <laughs> no, it's not. Oh. Oh. What was that? Oh. Someone there? Oh. I'm gonna start shooting! Oh. Fuck! Oh. Fuck. Oh. <laughs> yeah, you like that, don't you, huh? Take it off! <laughs> oh, oh. Get the oh. fuck off me! Uh, I, I thought I was on that guy! Oh. So you sit on his face? It's called teabagging? I really fucked him up good, though, huh? All right, listen, I'm gonna make a call. It's all gonna be okay. Stay put. came to my house, Lester. My house! So I asked Amanda and the kids to move out for a few days. I hate to say it, but Meriwether isn't short on excuses to come and kill you, nor is Devin Weston. I ain't looking for perspective, Lester. They came after my family. All right, all right. I, I don't know what to say. Does this change where you stand on the Union Depository? Hell no. We move on that right away. Before it gets any hotter. That's smart. Meet me at the strip joint. I'll get word to Frank and Trevor.
Michael! Did you find them? Who? The person who sent the mercenaries to our house! I'm working on it. Are we safe? You said we would be safe. He's not gonna try that again. I'm on top of this, Amanda. Trust me. Really? You're sure? I'm positive. Look, I love you. I'm gonna take care of this. My boy Mike, good to see you. Hey man, you're back to the, the intellect of the thug is victorious. Can you ask the DJ to play some hardcore? Hey, sorry I'm late. Oh, we were just talking about you. Well, don't worry. Another few hours, you never have to talk about me again, Trevor. You're the one who likes to talk. Watch your back. You too. That's all I'm saying. Fuck you. Fuck you, all right, excuse all right, all me! Right, enough! Huh? Enough! You're... Thank you. <clears throat> okay, uh, this is it. <laughs> well, we have two options. They're both a little, uh... <laughs> out there, but then again, what do you expect? Okay, option one. We hijack their armored cars. We take the crews hostage, and then we infiltrate the depository. Now, once you're in there and you've got the score, we send in a team of modded cars. You load up, you get out. And we need to infiltrate the transportation grid and manipulate it to aid our escape. But option two, we cause a distraction out front. Make them think we're dumb. <laughs> well, we've never had a problem convincing people of that, have we? <laughs> The other guys will be drilling, taking what they can. You're gonna be the distraction. Always the attention seeker. You know, for a guy who's always stepping on his friends to get ahead, he has an unfortunately low sense of self-worth. Okay, okay, let me show you the board. To uh, recap, these are our options. We try to make them give us the gold, or we drill a big old hole in the side of the bank and we take it out. If you're drilling a big old hole, you'll need a big old drill, a tunnel bore machine. I'll locate it, but you have to steal it and store it near the bank. Uh, they're excavating a new part of the metro network around there, so that's where you'll go in. Uh, we'll need choppers for the getaway, too. Uh, Trevor has one we can use, the other can be bought. The guys on the ground will need a getaway car, so get something fast and tough, and then modify it as much as you can to increase your chances of getting away from the cops. And it's gotta be stored in a parking garage near the UD. Uh, there's gonna be a lot of heat, so think about that. Um, I'm forgetting something. Uh, oh, that's it. <laughs> we'll need a train to land the gold on and take it to the warehouse. You'll have to steal it. Uh, again. I'll send you the details. Now, if you're interested in the more, um, subtle approach, hijacking the armored cars and so on, huh? you've got to get some police stingers. Only cops are licensed to have them, so that's a headache of its own. Oh, what else? Um, oh, right, uh, you'll need to get a hold of and mod some getaway cars. Uh, normal suspension's gonna give out under a couple of tons of gold. Whoa, man, a couple of tons? Four tons in total. <laughs> and that's what I can get the system to divert into the cage we're hitting. Fuck me! Okay, okay, last thing. You remember that underpass we saw from the helicopter? No, well, that's where I'll set up the uh, smoke and mirrors to get the cops off your scent. I've heard that before. Michael, subtle or obvious, what's it going to be? Hmm. <laughs> <laughs> Hmm. Um, all right. Uh, we're go The first driver will pilot one of the choppers getting you out of there. Half the gold will be in that chopper. So these better be some safe effing hands. And the second driver's in charge of the train. I don't think we need to hire someone very expensive for this. Eddie Toe. Now you can count on him to get you out of a spot.
Gunman 1 is with Franklin, burrowing in and pulling out the gold. Gunman 2 hits the bank lobby with you and makes it look like you're a couple of idiots trying your luck. They were at the jewelry store and the bureau, and we ain't dead yet. We'll only get one shot at this thing. Is this the shot we want to take? Great. All right. We get the tunnel bore machine, and we're good to go. Fucking glory seeker. Oh, you got any better ideas? Obviously not, otherwise you already killed me and done the gig yourself. I mean, what kind of...